Hey everyone, I'm Katherine McCormick. Welcome to CLI Studio's YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be sharing with you an exercise that I personally use to remain mindful and curious within improvisation. For me personally, improv is something that I didn't really practice when I was younger and it wasn't until I was moving into the professional dance world that I started to explore it. And that led me to feel pretty intimidated getting to know my body, especially when I was in front of other people. So it's taken me time to learn to build confidence in my voice and in making choices. And so I don't know if you relate to me, but if you do, hopefully this exercise can be something that can help to support you along your journey. What we're gonna be doing today is called ladder flow movement. And I actually have a full class on this on CLI Studio. So if you wanna check that out for a deeper dive, go for it. Today we're gonna be doing a more condensed version. We're gonna start with three standard movements. So this is gonna be your choreography. I think this exercise does a really great job at demonstrating how in improv we don't always have to add extra. We can uncover what is already in the body and also play with the choreography that has been given. So we'll start with three standard movements. From there, play with organizing them in a ladder flow, which I'll explain a little bit more in a second, and then play with making them your own. Let's give it a shot. Here we go. Okay, so let's begin. I'm gonna start by giving you three standard movements. These standard movements are gonna start facing the front, taking three walks back. So left, right, left. From here, you're gonna look over your left shoulder and allow your toes to shift towards the back diagonal. So look, and from this space, we're gonna play with expansion and contraction. So opening the chest and allowing it to soften as well. So those are your three standard movements that we're gonna play with. Let's do it again. So starting, we'll call this walk, look, open, close. That's what we're playing with. So let's start to build this in a ladder sequence, meaning we're gonna play with the first step, then the first and second step, then start over the first, second, and third step. So we're gonna walk, walk, look, walk, look, open, close. So it'll be like this, working with standard movement. So starting out, walk, repeat from where you are, walk, look, repeat from where you are, walk, look, open, close. So these are the three standard movements in a ladder flow. Now what we're gonna do is play with making these movements your own. So for the walks, maybe you desire to change your direction, go forward instead of back. Maybe for the walks, you try to mix your feet up a little bit where you don't really go anywhere, you're staying in place. Maybe for the walks, you play with using your hands to walk in space or your fingers to walk in space. If you come up with a different idea, go with that. It doesn't have to make sense to anybody but you. Three walks. As you look, maybe you play with looking slowly. Maybe you play with looking quickly in multiple directions. You could even play with imagining that your elbows had eyes and your elbows could look into a different space. From there, open, close, expansion and contraction. We have so many ways that we can play with this, even if it's just taking a moment to notice your breath. It could be playing with your hands, open, close. You could play with external, internal rotation, open, close. So you truly can do whatever comes to mind following your impulses. So let's build this on with a ladder flow, making it your own, all right? I'll say it out loud with you. Three walks, however you like. Starting over from here, three walks. Look. Starting over from here, three walks. Look. Open. Close. Let's try it one more time, and I won't say the words this time. And there you go. Thank you so much for taking a minute to play, to get curious. Uh, hopefully this is an exercise that you can put in your back pocket and you can use whenever you need it, whenever you need a little bit of support. 